This is your CBSLA.com News Brief. Hello and welcome to your CBSLA.com News Brief. I'm Amy Johnson. And that was the countdown at Grand Park in downtown LA. Thousands turned out despite the cold weather. You saw the virtual countdown clock projected on the side of City Hall. Three stages were set up with different DJs and groups and performers, all for the great entertainment. Well, police have a man in custody for questioning in a deadly accident in Newport Beach. They found the body of a man on East PCH at Newport Coast Drive. Police shut down all lanes on that busy stretch of the highway to conduct their investigation. Just outside Whittier, two people were killed in a head-on crash at First Avenue and Candlelight Drive. We know one victim was a man, the other a woman. Each driver was alone. Investigators haven't said yet what caused the head-on crash. Well, Chief Phillips are ending in California. The new year brings a new tax on all gasoline sales thanks to California's cap and trade law. It's supposed to offset greenhouse gas emissions. It's not clear how much gas will go up. Analysts have given numbers anywhere from 9 cents to 76 cents per gallon. For the latest on these stories and your news any time of day, stay with CBSLA.com. A frosty start to your New Year's with temperatures bottoming out in the 20s and the 30s overnight into the afternoon. We'll warm up into the 50s and 60s, so we're staying well below freezing. We're going to keep frost advisories and freeze warnings in effect for the Southland until about Friday morning. Keeping these cold temperatures in effect, that cold snap will continue until about Saturday. We warm up on Sunday. That's your forecast. Have a great New Year's. And that's your CBSLA.com News Brief. Remember, we're always on. Click Listen Live on our webpage to hear KNX News Radio and our other stations live anywhere you are.